do wood turning. I've been doing it for probably two years. I like to do uh, mostly pens, um, but I also do little little bowls and goblets and cups and things like that too. I use this, this machine called a lathe. And essentially, I attach a piece of wood to a motor and it turns the piece of wood as I, as I carve at it and I get to make whatever I want out of that piece of wood. I uh, actually, when I graduated from college, my parents bought me a mini lathe. It's just, it's something they knew I had an interest in. It's not something I'd ever tried before, but after seeing lots of videos on YouTube and Facebook, just searching of things that people make, and over time I accrued the tools needed and, uh, and the materials needed as well, and just tried it and fell in love with it. I really didn't know if I was gonna be any good at it, and truly at first I wasn't. But over time, I started to get good at it, and I started developing these little techniques that were uh, that are unique to me. You know, there's so many different people to tell you this is the best way to do this, this is the best way to do that. Um, these are the best materials. Uh, but over time, I think you kind of just get your own your own rhythm, and I, I think I'm there by this point. I love that no two pieces are the same. You know, the wood it's. Uh, there's so many different types of wood, so many different types of grain. There's so many defects in the wood that make them very unique and different from one another. I mean, I could, I could make two pens out of the same piece of wood and, and they turn out completely different. And you don't know what it's gonna look like until you're at the very end. And I think that's, I think that's the coolest thing about it. I think people know me for the pens that I make. A lot of drivers, uh, of, of our night transportation drivers, they'll, uh, I've had many, purchase pens for me. I've also, I, I, I like giving them, giving them out as, as gifts uh, to drivers. Uh, we just had a driver who, he hit his million miler mark and he overcame cancer and I, I gave him a pen just as a uh, congrats and, and we're happy you're with us and I engraved his name on it just to make it personal for him. A couple of years back for uh, Driver Appreciation Week, we raffled off a bunch of items and one of the items we raffled off was I made a couple of pens. It was actually a pen and pencil set and I engraved the night logo on it. And I, I, I like to think I've incorporated my hobby into the culture here at night.